Welcome to Vagabond Builds with James and Sandu, and today we're doing another product review here on our channel with regards to the UDIAG powerful scan tool. And we're gonna talk a little bit about the exterior of how it feels, what it looks like, how they designed it, and these special functions, because I know that's why you're here. Before we dive in and stop wasting your time, please like and subscribe to our channel because we truly need your guys' support. We thank you for that as well. Now, let's go ahead and dive in and stop wasting your time. This is a 36 millimeter ultra thin scan tool, 4.3 inch LCD screen. It is colored. You can do OBD1 and OBD2. Things that come into the box, of course, you get the box, you get a little simple user manual, which is very consumer friendly. It is stupid proof. You have the OBD2 cable plug-in. You will need an OBD1 adapter. Um, they don't give you one. You have the scan tool itself, okay, with your buttons on the right and on the left to control. And also the USB card here, which you're going to do the internet updatable via the USB card with the little handy dandy, take it anywhere, you diag case. Okay. Now you want to get to the point. What does this thing do? I made some notes right here on my left. Uh, it does do over a hundred makes and models of vehicles. You got the, uh, the Asians, right? The Chinese, the European, the American cars. Does OBD1, OBD2, I did mention that. Does uh, cars, SUVs, trucks sold worldwide. So if you have an OBD2, OBD2 plug, this will pick it up. It does erase trouble code. So if you have a check engine light, this is something that it will pick up. It also picks up on codes for your transmission and many others like your DPF system and all that good stuff. I'm going to mention that here. It also does show live data. Okay. Graph graph live data. It does have over 40 plus special functions. And I'm going to read a few of them that I uh, made a list. It does do uh, oil service resets, ABSs, EPBs, airbags, AT adaptation. Uh, it does BCM, SIRS settings, injector coating, which is a great one. Battery configuration does check your battery also. DPF, IMMO, gear learning, and so much more. And I'm gonna show you guys that, okay? A little few more things. It does pick up your VIN number, so it does automatically read your VIN number when your ignition is on with your engine off. Um, it, I did mention the 4.3, and it is a rugged, ruggedized, um, built with rubber on the right and on the left, so it will support tough workshops environments, okay? Now let's go ahead and show you guys the most important part of this video and jump inside the car. Now we're sitting inside one of our personal vehicles and I just want to kind of go ahead and go through the list with you guys and show you guys because a lot of people are going to ask me, does it do this? Does it do that? And I want to just do a quick um, look over what it actually does. And I have to say this has a lot of special functions. Now let's go ahead and shoot over to this four inch screen. It is not touch sensitive, so people might ask me that as well. It does OBD2 and it does scan all your monitors, your um yeah, your monitors or your computers, okay? And I'm not going to do that because it's going to take a long time for that 100% scan. But I just want to kind of show you guys a quick list of what it does. So you do have the OBD2. Let's go into that real quick. Now, it does let you know, look, your um, engine light, the MIL status, codes found, monitors and A, monitors okay. You're ready for smog here in California. I know we hate our California smog um, regulations. But we're going to go ahead and... Click F3 for OK. You got the transmission control module, engine control modules, another engine con uh, transmission control module. We're going to go ahead and click Enter on the engine. And this is where you're going to see the system status, the read codes, erase codes. This is where you're going to do a lot of your check engine light stuff. Uh, if you're trying to diag a problem, diagnose a problem. Live data, I'm going to show you guys that real quick too. Car's not on, but I just want to show you guys what the live data list does look like. Now, this is what your live data will look like, your list. And you can go ahead and go down. You got your fuel system, your fuel trim, bank ones, um, your intake manifold, absolute pressures, and just so much more. Your speed sensors, engine RPM. It actually picks up a lot of live data, everyone. And I have to say, for a little $400 computer, you're not spending $2,000 for a computer that will help you pick up this. So I would have to say this is an intermediate powerful scan tool. Why do I say that? Because if you get those palm held at your nearest auto parts stores like uh, AutoZone, um, O'Reilly, uh, Napa, you also have the advanced auto parts, 
those will not pick up as much as this is doing, okay? And those guys are charging you the same amount. If we go ahead and go back, now I did show you guys the live data. We come back to this. I'm gonna show you guys a quick list of exactly battery testing, oil reset, EPB testing, throttle reset. I literally had to do this on a 2020 Nissan Versa just recently, and I actually had to use one of my friend's computers, and now it's great, okay? Aero fuel ratio, DPF. Um, I find myself using that in the future on a diesel that we have. Also, the injector coating, steering angle. I had to do this on a 2017 Camaro SS recently. I wish I would have had it. Immobilizer, you can actually... Um, set your key fobs to the exact vehicle. Gear learning, ABS bleed system, if you have uh, a brake job. TPA MS, this is for your tires. Okay, if you wanna uh, relearn your sensors to the exact car, you have that. Odometer, you have the sunroof system. So much more, look at this. Gearbox, suspension, your headlight. You can change your language, your seat matching. I have to do that on a lot of my cars because when those airbags blow and that sensor on the seat does blow, you actually will have to match your seat. That's super cool too. Clutch adaptation. I don't do a lot of clutches. I got guys to do that for me. But again, look at all this turbo system. You got your primer fuel pump, airbag reset. We actually have an airbag code on this um, 2022 HRV. 23, yeah. Change tire size, EVAP testing, EGR reset, TCM oil reset, setup, and then we have the playback, okay? All those special functions literally would save you thousands of dollars if you had this computer at home, okay? Hopefully our review did help you guys out. Uh, we tried to show you guys exactly kind of what you have with regards to options and what it does. You can update it, don't forget. Save yourself some money with our coupon code in the description below, everyone. I can't emphasize this enough, save your money. Okay, buy this computer, don't take your car to the dealer if you are kind of intuitive with finding out or troubleshooting issues with your vehicles, okay? Thank you so much for watching our channel here at Vagabond Builds. Ask us questions, tell us your concerns. We'll try to get back to you guys as best as possible. Thank you, like and subscribe once again, and God bless you.